I'm really excited to pick up these PR packages. Just, just, just say bonjour. Like there's nothing else you can say to me when I'm wearing this. Oh my goodness. Okay, let me get into the next box. I don't even want to take this off. Bonjour, mes amis. I'm still the voice. It, it's coming back. Watch Tuesday's vlog to see how this all unfolded. <laughs> St. Moi, Jesse, your resident Francophile, and here on Cappuccinos and Consignment, I focus on lifestyle, travel, and finance. Cebu Play, take a moment to like, subscribe, and follow. Follow me over on Insta. I have a blog on TikTok. You have to just search Pour Moi because I am shadow banned. But guess what? That did not stop me from hitting 16K. <laughs> Today, it is 9.35 a.m. and I am getting ready for an interview. I have an interview for a publication. Really, really thrilled about that. I have to get better at sharing the links here. I always share them on more so Insta, not even TikTok because I don't know if it's an option to link in TikTok with your stories or if I don't have the capability yet, I don't know. But I always share these things on Insta, so I, I need to get better. I'll start sharing links here. I am, I'm just beyond delighted in trying to get this together. <laughs> I am beyond delighted. To date, I have been quoted in Forbes, New York Magazine. I have an actual magazine publication where I will be featured, like photos and all. And if you watched a few vlogs back where I was doing like a winter photo shoot in 90 plus degree, like 30 Celsius weather, that's what it was for. But today I have an interview. I am going to hop on that call in a bit. I'll let you all get a little snippet, but of course I can't share everything. And then we need to head out to pick up some PR packages. I love this pour moi. <laughs> I'm really excited to pick up these PR packages. One is from a brand that I have worked with before, just like gifted products. The actual, the house dress that you all absolutely adore they sent me a new one so i want to try that on because i feel like i was the first person they made because these robes are custom made i feel like i was the first person they made a tall robe for if you are new here we i am five nine i am pretty tall and buying things off the rack doesn't always fit so there's that but i'm really really excited about that and there are some other brands you all will see it all so i will do a try on as much as i i just i do not like trying on clothes but i will do it this time around and i have been shopping i have been shopping like a mad woman it's really it hasn't been that much quantity wise but the price tag of the items have been pretty steep. So I will link everything that I have purchased recently below. I have shared them here, the community with just photos and like static posts. But on Insta, I share those in my stories and I feel like I put them on the blog as well. Yes, yeah, so I'm really excited about those pieces. They are all for the fall, but well, really not even just the fall. Well, one piece is for the fall because of the color and the texture, but the other trench, that's going to be worn year round. So I don't think those packages will arrive today. So that'll be a separate like try on vlog, but I'll still go ahead and link those below. Yeah, and we will just catch up. So right now I want to, I'll lower the camera, get some jazzy tunes, but I want to go over these interview questions really quick so that we can chop chop. So I will see you all throughout the vlog. It's kind of child for now. <laughs> singing in the tub I was singing my heart out and I hit a few notes that I discovered that I um, cannot hit successfully so yeah just recovering from that <laughs> I started traveling 
is they're the same looks and it works. I just wrapped up the interview. Now I am going to head down, make a smoothie and head out to run some errands. So let's get to getting Ciao for now. Dakar, it is a lot of people out. Hello. So I don't want to get any faces. I had to stop to get my car washed. I don't know what pooped on my car. It had to have been like a pterodactyl. Like it was huge. It's so gross. I could not find parking. I'm really hoping it's not gigantic boxes because well, it's not that big of a walk. Not big of a walk. It's not that long of a walk but it will be so uncomfortable with big boxes. So, uh, oh, okay, no, perfect, you're all okay. okay. We are back with the PR goodies, one of which came right on time. I burnt my face the other day. This is, <laughs> it brings back memories. When I was like, when I returned from South Africa or going to South Africa, I can't remember the sequence of events, but I was staying with a dear friend of mine and I love sheet masks, all kind of face masks. Like while I'm not into makeup, I'm into just beauty and skincare kinds of things. So I had this <laughs> face mask that I swear I had on for like two days. I was going through a lot mentally and emotionally. It was just a very weird time in my life returning back from South Africa. That was ooh, maybe, I don't know, that has to be in the memoir. I don't think I'll share that here, but that was just a very difficult time in my life. And I knew I wasn't going anywhere. I put this mask on and I offered one to my friend. I swear I left that mask on for maybe 48 hours. Who, who knows? She had the mask on for four minutes, not even four minutes. Her entire face was beat red. It was awful. Like we thought we were going to have to go to urgent care. That's how bad it was. So ever since then, I have been just so scared. And this was before I ever picked up. I don't even think I had social media then. Did I? Yeah, a personal one well before I started content creating. So every time I start talking about skincare, I always think about that and I just get so scared, but this is different. <laughs> I have actually worked with Good Molecule before. I'm on like a PR basis, they sent me a package. So this was really a pleasant surprise. And again, very, very timely. So I will flip the camera and let you all see what I have. Packaging is always so nice that's one thing I absolutely love I am all about the packaging Ooh, an instant cleansing balm I am all about oil like hydration oils that's one of my favorite things a toner I feel like I've had this toner before but it was a much larger bottle all right good molecules don't don't shortchange me the bottle I had before was huge in this serum. So yeah, I will let you all know how this turns out. So next are pieces that I need to try on. Let me move a few things around and try this on for you all. I always start filming with it upside down. The Red Circus. Ah, I am so thrilled about this. This is the robe I was telling you all about. So yeah, let me... Let me try this on. This, oh my goodness, look at this. <gasps> okay, let me try it on. Okay, don't play with it, don't play with it. I need you to focus, camera. Focus on the fabulous Ness. Come on. <laughs> O-M-G. Oh, this is, this is insane. I thought the other robe was my favorite look at this and it has a collar oh my goodness i have to message the owner like as soon as i finish recording i love that they always have pockets this is perfection so my other the robe that i'm always in and you all always say how much you love it 
that robe does not have a collar. It has a bit of a standing collar, but this, what? Oh my God. Come on. I'm like, I can't even think of anything else to say. Come on. <sighs> Insane. Okay, so while I'm still in the spirit of trying on, let me open up the next box. Oh, I love it. I am about to shower and I always wash everything even when I first get it. Yeah, I am about to put this on, pour a glass of wine and... <laughs> Y'all not gonna be able to tell me nothing, okay? I'm just being honest. You cannot tell me. When I'm wearing this, just, 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 just say bonjour. Like there's nothing else you can say to me when I'm wearing this. Oh my goodness. Okay, let me get into the next box. I don't even wanna take this off. I said I was done, but it's, it's the details, pour moi. You all know as a fashion designer, as a pattern maker, these things mean so much to me. I mean, look at the piping that's added here. Absolute perfection. This is worth every single penny. Oh, the construction. Look at this. Okay, let me get into the next box. I'm so fancy. Oh, you can't hear me. I'm so fancy. Everlane was so gracious and let me pick out three pieces that I wanted and you all know that I am just obsessed with outerwear as if I need anything else. I, I couldn't resist, so let me try this on. I am just outerwear. <laughs> I had to get a storage unit because of the outerwear. We're really the changes that are happening up in the loft. If you are new here, the loft is typically where I store um, a lot of my vintage outerwear, vintage goods, and all the things, but we are in the process of doing redesigning. So yeah, the things had to go. I actually need to get up there and finish cleaning up, but we am really, really excited about this. Better factories, better quality, better prices. That's our promise. We reveal the story behind every product from our ethical manufacturing process to our transparent pricing breakdown. That's what I have come to love about this company once I was invited to get the PR package. I wanted to look into it. Manufacturing, production, all of those things mean a great deal to me as I alluded to with the robe. I was a fashion designer. I have worked in factories for big, big companies. I was a textile designer. I know the other side of fashion and I really know how ugly it can get. And I can just be totally transparent with you all as I always am being quasi classified as like this fashion style influencer content creator what have you it is very rare that we see full unboxings or these big old hauls i stopped doing unboxings as a i won't say as a whole because there are certain things that i still unbox like that whole paris thing. I could not not share that. But I really don't do a lot of hauls and it's for the reason of sustainability, manufacturing, and just the overproduction, all of those things. But then I still like to have nice things and new things. Like so that that's just the constant battle, the reality of it. I I, I can't speak for all of those in the the sphere of sustainability, but there's definitely a balance that comes with this part of it with content creation and especially if you are a visual content creator. I think it's a little more flexibility if you're audio based or if you are blog based but when you show up on camera, photos, all of those things, it's an added layer of pressure I would say to, to have the latest, the greatest and I'm not that person but I do like getting things and having nice things. So voila. And I am loving, oh my God, look at this. So I'm going to flip the camera, but this is one of the things that it's always an issue for me. Sleeve length has always been an issue, pour moi. And that is, it's my height. And I just have freakishly long arms. I don't know if I have normal length arms for my size. 
and my height, but it is always a challenge. And it used to bother me when I was a kid. It used to really, really bother me. Now I push up the sleeves and keep it moving. This is a really nice fit. Okay, let me flip the camera. This is so tailored and polished. Yeah, this is good. I, I made the right choice. I, of course, was just drawn to black, but I'm so glad I got this camel color. This is so nice. I don't feel like trying this on. I'm just going to hold it up. I'm going to try this on. I'm changing. That's why the camera is facing there. I thought I ordered a sweater. I guess I was debating between the two items, and I think I told them whichever was in stock. I would take so it's the shirt dress that's in stock so I do not mind trying that on I just I really didn't feel like trying on a sweater let's see let's see okay oh this is nice and crisp oh my let me get this button so I can show you all oh this is so good you are going to love it. A crisp shirt dress. And look at the length. Look at the length. It is below my knees. This is the perfect shirt dress. The height. <laughs> there are times when I find shirt dresses, but they hit like right above the knee. And I prefer my dresses much longer than that. So this is absolute perfection. I'm actually, I'm going to wear this. Oops, peekaboo. <laughs> I'm actually going to wear this very soon, like possibly tomorrow. Okay, let me get back into my dress. Oh, I love this. Let me know, what do you all think about this, the shirt dress and the coat? I will link everything below. Okay, let me change out. So proud of myself for doing that try on. <laughs> like, it is just not something that I enjoy. So now that I tried on that coat, I feel like I'm going to do, once the recent orders that I shared with you all, I think at the beginning of this vlog come in, I'm going to do a fall something, some kind of fall try on where I will actually style the pieces. And at least at that time, I'll mentally be prepared to change looks and all. But yeah, I, I'm really, really thrilled about this. This shirt dress, <laughs> I have a lot of shirt dresses, okay? But the fabric, this quality is really, really high end. You can tell the difference with how it holds its structure. That makes me really happy. So yeah, and the vlogs to come, I don't want to say the next vlog because it really, it's contingent on when I get my other packages in. I will do a fall, kind of pre-fall styling, showing you all some of the pieces that I have that are new in and how I plan to pull them together. So merci beaucoup for spending just like some random time at Ekmoa. I now realize I did not vlog much while I was out. Some of the errands that I ran were personal, so of course I'm not gonna show those things, but be that as it may, merci beaucoup. I appreciate you all so much. If you are ever interested in any of the pieces that I am wearing or you see or that I post, see to play, be sure to use the link. That helps me out so much. It really, really does. And I appreciate you all endlessly for the continued love and support. So until the next vlog or every day on Insta and TikTok. <laughs> Ciao for now.